quote hangs on your wall. Welcome to Goal Getting Quote of the Day. I'm Tony Woodall, your host, and I will share with you a great quote I've heard, read, or that's been shared by one of my guests on Goal Getting Podcast Weekly Show, where I ask, what quote hangs on your wall? Thanks for listening, folks, and I really appreciate it. Today's podcast is brought to you by Audible.com. Get a free audiobook and 30-day free trial at www dot goalgettingbook dot com over a hundred and fifty thousand titles to choose from for your iPhone, Android, Kindle, or MP3 player. Hey, goal getters! Thank you for joining us on Goal Getting Quote of the Day. I really appreciate you showing up today. If this is your first time, thank you for visiting. If this is your many time, I appreciate you coming back and joining us. I love having you visiting. You have a lot of choices in podcasts. I appreciate you stopping by mine. Today's quote is from Jim Herbert, and it's, remember, it's the 18th hole. Now, I was reading one of the best advice I've ever received blogs on our internal social intranet that I became the community manager of back in September. We ask our executive management team to share the best advice they've ever received with our internal community. I saw the one from our CEO, Jim Herbert, and I thought the quote was great, but the story better. I asked Jim permission to share this on the show, and he said, yes, of course. So, of course, I'm now sharing that with you. So the best advice ever received for for Jim Herbert, the CEO of First Republic Bank, where I work, was a story that he told us, and this is where it goes. When I was young, I used to caddy at a nearby golf course. One day, I had the opportunity to caddy for an expert golfer who had a very big bag of clubs that seemed larger than my kid-sized frame. As we came to the 18th hole, I was very tired from carrying my golfer's heavy bag of clubs. I was carrying out my duty as a caddy by holding the flag while my golfer took his final putt. But at that moment, my exhaustion took over and I moved. The one thing a caddy must never do, especially on the final hole. Clearly distracted, the golfer stood up looked at me, and motioned to stand still. After he made his putt, he put his arm around me as we started walking back to the clubhouse and said, Kid, that was a big mistake. As I began to apologize for moving, he let me know that I had not only made one big mistake, I made two. I looked back at him perplexed. I could only remember moving the flag. He begins to explain what happened. First, you move the flag. Second, you move the flag on the 18th hole. That's when I'm deciding how much to tip you. I've never forgotten that moment, and it still rings true to everything that I do today. The lesson that I never forget is to always see things through to the very end. When I'm thinking about how to act in the final minutes of whatever it is I'm working on, I always remind myself It's the 18th hole. Well, thank you, Jim. That's a great quote to remember. It's amazing how much golf can teach you about life, business, and goals. When things are almost done, when you've delivered your final product, your service, your attitude, remember, it's the 18th hole. When your tip depends on it, how are you going to finish? What great advice and a great quote to hang on your wall. Remember, it's the 18th hole. So go out today, play hard, work hard. Remember at the end, it's the 18th hole. Thank you, Goal Getters. I appreciate you listening to a show today uh, from Jim Herbert and myself. I think this is a great quote. Uh, It brings a lot of lessons to it to remember that it's the 18th hole. And I want to thank you for joining us today. And I really would love it if you uh, have some thoughts on this quote and any others, go to our show notes page today at goalgettingpodcast.com forward slash QOD171 and give me your feedback in the comment section. I would greatly appreciate it. Now, are you a goal getter that wants to learn how to master goal getting? Well, we started a private Facebook group to help you have a place where you can meet other like-minded, goal-oriented people that will support you and help you get the goals you set. 
If you want to be part of the Goal Getting Masters group, go to goalgettingpodcast.com forward slash masters. Sign up and I will add you to the group. Come prepared to participate and share your goals with other goal getters. Thank you for listening to Goal Getting Quote of the Day. If you like this or any of our quotes, please tell your family and your friends. Let them know so that they can come join us and hear us too. You can give them directions to go to goalgettingpodcast.com forward slash iTunes where they can easily subscribe to our show on iTunes there and we would appreciate it. So thank you so much for listening. Go out today and make it a great day.